Hi everyone. We're continuing on with our investigation into the all of the different events that are escalating all around the world with Russia amassing troops and the missing flight 370 and all of the other signs of pressure and tension that we're reaching the end of the line, the end of the age. In the Bible it's talked of that we're nearing the end of what is called the fourth age and the beginning of the age of the beast, the fifth age, the big V, the the time of judgment upon the earth, Mark of the Beast and World War III and such coming. And that is shown to us in many different ways. Well, this weekend also coming up is the season four finale of The Walking Dead. And this show has an awful lot of symbolism of the end of days coming. I mean, the dead are up and walking around. And the main star, Rick, is like Justice, one of the horsemen who has risen up. And now they're all on the way to Terminus. The main theme that has been going on with the symbolism around the world is that we're nearing the end of the line. Basically, the end of the tracks are coming. The, the end, Armageddon. Terminus means the end of a railroad or other transportation route or a station at such a point. A terminal. The end. The end of the line coming. In here, Michonne was representing even one of the horsemen. All of them were. You could have associated them all with the four horsemen coming. And then when they took down the governor, the one-eyed man, went the time when the dead is rising. So you can see that this symbolism is all around us. Well, I wanted to point out that, well, many people have been pointing out that this Flight 370 symbolism has been shown in this Man of Steel movie, the Superman movie, and has all types of associations with the Indian Ocean and the Flight 370, and people are finding these connections everywhere. There is a real possibility to, that this flight could be used as an attack on the USA for some type of nuclear advice. You know, nuclear device. Well, in this video game right here, called Injustice, Gods Among Us, that came out in 2013, it shows New York nuked. And then Superman basically going crazy, and he starts the New World Order. A lot like in this movie over here, right in here, where Superman fought Zod, and all of the world was practically destroyed. Well, in this one, he saved Lois and everybody, but in this story, Lois and all of his friends die from the big event of Zod and everybody, basically. Joker is Zod in this one, if you wanted to associate that. But J the Joker has set off a nuclear bomb and messed with Superman. He had basically given him some type of drug. But all of his friends had died, and now he had started the New World Order around the world. But do you see this right here? The Daily Planet, on the opening scene, they make sure it just says plane. It says A-L plane. You can't really see the T on it at all. We're going to watch this trailer through here now and see if you notice any of the other symbolism of the end of the age coming. In this video game, the New World Order starts right after this event.
nuke. Where'd you get it? What? You want one? Copy that. <laughs> get away from him! I'm handling this. Drugged me! Made me... Lois... My son... First Krypton, now Metropolis. People you love tend to blow up, don't they? Huh? Superman, don't! Uh. That's why I like you, Superman. You're much more gullible than... A family that locking me up will magically reform me and they'll be safe so big so dumb <laughs> now run along so I can break out of here I've got lots of planning to do to top this that's enough Well, in this game, that's the beginning of the New World Order, right there. And then, well, in the game, they go get another Superman from another dimension to do the big fights. But it all starts with this big event. Some type of, just like the last time when they bombed the World Trade Centers, that this would start World War III. And you can see that it says plane right there instead of planet. And then the nukes have gone off. Well, as we showed before about the fifth age coming, you see here is the scene now. And do you see over here the big V for the fifth age coming? The age of the beast all upon the earth and destruction coming. This is real. It's right in front of us. We don't know the days, times, or hours, but we, we are being told in every way possible that we're nearing the end of the line just as in the Lone Ranger movie that we broke down that shows the white horse riding and all the way through it they kept saying it's the end of the line that we're nearing the time of the end all right here may the Lord Jesus Christ have mercy on us all there were several other instances of the number 370 all through the Man of Steel movie and like I was saying the Joker would end up being Zod and in this Superman kills the Joker. May the Lord Jesus Christ have mercy on us all. Let's all just keep on going and trying to find as much evidence as we can that the world is heading towards a change. Confess with your mouth the Lord is Jesus. Believe in your heart God hath risen him from the dead and you'll be saved. Hallelujah. They could use this plane as a giant 911 event to start World War III. It is not beyond possibility. It has happened before. Jesus have mercy on us all.